It's back people, the big hunt is back. Now we are in old London town, Tower Bridge behind me. We are here to find the best pie and mash in London. Pie, mash and liquor. Oh yeah. So Bruce, we gotta go liquor. What about eels? We may have to try, I've never tried a jelly deal. Never tried it. We may have to try one. When in London and all that, or when in Rome, we, when in London. To sit back, relax, watch two big hunts, fill themselves with pie and mash. <laughs> This one could be a tough one. On electric. On electric motorcycles. What do we let ourselves in for? <laughs> Job C, roll the intro. What can go wrong? What are you going to put in? It can't be that bad, surely. <laughs> Not for you. <laughs> Ten of these. It's Not hardly. Maureen's. You hungry, Bruce? <sighs> Let's do it. It's only the second one. The things we do for you. Good gravy. Jesus, you'll get lynched. The sauce. He's promised me he's going to clear his plate this time. So Listen, I, I might side. moan about being full, but I'm going to see it through. I'm not <laughs> wimping out. Oh, we can't leave this little bit here, Bruce. He, he's going to get lonely on his own sat there. Even though this is the fifth one of the day, I am still enjoying it. I am as well, actually. Yeah. Hey, Bruce, I think your airbag's gone off, mate. Oh, no, no, it hasn't, don't worry. I'm, I'm going off the liquor. Bound off. So this is our third big hunt, Bruce. This is the third time we've been on the quest to find the best food. First of all, of course, we had the best pasty in Cornwall. Link up the top. Then Bruce did the best fish and chips on the northeast. Yarp. Link up the top. And today we are doing the best pie and mash in London. Pie and mash is a massive Cockney favourite, I guess if we could call it. You know, the, the, they call it the original fast food in London. So I think mid-Victorian times it all, it all started with the pie and mash. So it's pie, mash and we've got to try a bit of liquor, Bruce. Have you tried this before? Not liquor, no. I'm, I, we've got to have liquor with it. Pie, mash and liquor. We've got to have liquor. I, I guess you've tried a pie before. I, I might have had the odd pie, yes. <laughs> the odd pie or two in our years. <laughs> I thought as we're going into London, what better way, oh, are you stopping Bruce, what better way than to do it on electric bikes. So I've got the Zero SRS, courtesy of Wheels Motorcycles. Thanks, Wheels. What you got, Bruce? Uh, this is the Energica Rebelli. Is this the RS? Can you see, is this RS? Uh, it is the RS. This, this is, is the, the RS, RS emblem. Then. Thank you very much to English Electric Motorcycles for this. Right, ready? Little drag race, yep. little drag race. So 50 miles an hour. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Whoa, Christ, Jesus, for Christ. <laughs> oh, it does me, it does me. It's got some snap to it, isn't it? Jesus, they, they kick initially. That took me by surprise. <laughs> I haven't been to London in years either. I can't even remember the last time I came to London. Certainly can't remember the last time I rode in London. I think I've ever ridden in London. I've never ridden in London before. Oh, do you not? I've driven, I've never ridden in London before. Oh, this could be fun. I used to do it every single day. You'll be having PTSD coming back into oh, London mate, again. Yeah. <laughs> I kept getting knocked off. BJ's Pie and Mash. Like a nice BJ. I think they only do pies here, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> Such a child. BJ's pie and mash. What's Quality. that there? Bit of history. Good Bit proper history. London hospitality. Loving yeah, it. Yeah, that's what we like. Have we ordered then, Bruce? Have we ordered? Not yet. Not yet. What are we going for? Pie and mash. <laughs> <laughs> do any kebabs? So you're our first stop of the day. So uh, we've never had, uh, we've never had authentic. Cockney pie and mash oh, either, so oh, this will be our first one. First one. So all we're going to compare it to is going to be tricky. It to me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, You're setting the standard. I'm, I'm here at the moment. By the end of the day, I could be going. Out, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be calling you now. Yeah. Right. So oh. you're going to have a single, aren't you? Yeah, single. Are you having eels at all? Yeah, well, we've got to try. We've got to try in it. I think we've got to try one. Right. You've got to just. You're not, you're not keen on. We'll do, we'll do one say, between the two. One between the two. Pound for pound, the dearest fish in the sea. Right. Right. So. I may give you, because I'm on, I'm on YouTube, <laughs> I could, I'll give you two pieces, Love right? It. Just to try it. You Appreciate get about that. five, six pieces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll give you two pieces each. One jelly, one stew. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you're not supposed to use a knife. Right. It's okay. going to be a right. spoon. So you use a spoon. Right, okay. Right. All the coin, what chilli, you stopped. All the coin, what chilli vinegar you want, or plain vinegar. 
chilli, the, the big one, a bit too hot, the other one just gives it a little bit of a kick. Right. Alright, so a bit of pepper, a bit of salt, well, you don't really need salt, but a bit of pepper and a bit of vinegar. Okay. And you're right. Right, All right. beautiful. And I'll sort your eels out. Spot on. Cheers, mate. Right. Cheers, mate. Let's give it a whirl. Thanks, Cheers, mate. Alright, here we go. Look at this. So, a couple of forks and spoons. A little bit of jack in there. <coughs> it's not actually tapped down all through. Mmm, I like that, I like that. Mm. Yeah, it's parsley, isn't it? Parsley sauce with a little bit of eel juice in there. Right, let's get in here for this pie. Mm. Pie's good, lovely crusty pastry on top. Ten of these. It's not happening. <laughs> Ten, <laughs> bloody hell. Now normally I'd like salty potatoes but you really don't need salty potatoes because the rest of it's quite salty, isn't it? I think the mash is just potato. They don't put butter in anything. It's mm. just potato. Mm. Yeah. Hey, I've done that. my research. I, mean, I can't pop it all in, I? I was going to have a little pink on the side of it. Are you going to pop it in? When in round. <laughs> when in round, pop it in. In with an eel. We're going for jelly deal first. We've never tried it, oh. but you've got it, haven't you? Oh, at least man, at one place. Oh, I mean, visually, no. Just no. You're going to put the whole thing in? Yeah. That's what you're supposed to do, isn't it? It's going for the whole thing. And you've got to suck it off the bone. I feel sick. Get it in. Oh, God. It's just a fish. Just think of it as a nice bit of fish, battered fish. Nice bit of battered fish. I would have thought. Nice bit of battered fish going Jesus. in. <laughs> it can't be that bad, surely. Not for you. you go, oh, I don't know if I can pop it all in. You've got to pop it all in your mouth. Do it's it. going to scrape a bit of the jelly off. I don't like pork pies when they got like that jelly in. Not yeah. like eels. <laughs> well, imagine really cold. <laughs> <laughs> was, that, the... was that a no? So, let's try this one. It's like a soggy fish. Just a fish. Yeah, really fishy. Um, soggy fish. Soggy not, fish. Not my cup of tea, but a lot better than that. <laughs> it's a bit like <laughs> a lot what we had in Whitby. Just fish, isn't it? It is. Mm. Very fishy. Mm. Fishy fish. There we are, BJ's Pie and Mash, and that's what you call good old Cockney hospitality in there, wasn't it? That was, that was brilliant, was wasn't it? What Spot a lovely on. geezer. Spot on. What was his name again? I can't remember. <laughs> lovely fella. If you want a bit of bit of history, you know, a bit of conversation with your meal, but it's the place to come, I think. That's it. Now we're on to Maureen's, two miles away. Maureen? <laughs> Maureen! Mate, I am so full. <laughs> I told you not to clear your plate, didn't I? What did I say? I said, don't clear your plate. <laughs> he didn't listen. Who'd have thought the fat lad would uh, f clear his plate, eh? I was brought up properly, me. Always finish your plate. Do you clear your plate? You're going to regret that later on. I know. Schmack goes the battery. How are you doing for charge? I've got 29 miles left. Uh, 28%. So I think after this one, we may have to think about <laughs> Yeah, charging up. And just to point out, you know, the energy crew had 95% when we set off, or 97, wasn't it? Yeah. This only had 60, so that's why this is a lot lower at the moment. Yeah. Look at you with your blooming turnips. What's this? <laughs> Bexy's Midnight Runners video? What's I'm going on? I'm in London, mate. I'm in London. You've got to get with the flow. <laughs> I want my next pie mash off a shovel. I'm a hipster now, didn't you? Didn't you get the Didn't you get the memo? Not seen your man bun. Well, the fact is, the trousers are just too long. It's not a styling <laughs> exercise. Just the trousers are too long. It's as simple as that. There you go. Look, parking right outside it. Gosh, I can't believe we're going to have another pie and mash. Are you hungry? Five minutes after the last one. Are you hungry, Bruce? <laughs> no. We have got to share a portion. We. <laughs> so pie and mash number two. Number two. Maureen's. We are at Maureen's. You hungry, Bruce? Let's do it. It's only the second one. The things we do for you. You're giving me some of this funny money, Bruce. Is that Scottish? Scottish. Proper stuff. That's worth 20 quid of English, that. <laughs> Will be soon. Look at that. Pie and mash. A bit of pepper. Look at that. Beautiful. We've already done the chilli, haven't we? Done the chilli. Right. I'm going in. Oh, I'm going to try the liquor first. 
fishy, maybe. Is it? A bit, oh, a bit okay. more of a fishy flavour to the liquor, perhaps. I was going to say that was a big spoonful, that, mm, but uh, your gob accommodated that quite easily. <laughs> it's a good pie. It's a good pie. Let's have one more little bit of that. Just to be sure. A bit of mash going in. Mm. More of a potatoey mash, perhaps. Mm. Very nice. Straight in for a bit of pie. Straight in. That's a good pie. It's a good pie. I it? think that's a better pie. Do you? Yeah, it's meatier. Wow. I thought the first pie was lovely, but that's really nice, really meaty. Tastier mash. I think it's slightly tastier, it's don't tastier you? Tastier mash. I didn't. I don't think the liquor on the first one. You could tell it was fishy. Well, I thought the opposite. Did you? Yeah, I, I thought the I thought the first one was fishier than this one. I hate to say it because the first geezer was so nice. It, it was like a proper experience, the first one. Mm. I think that as a package tastes better. Just, just slightly meatier pie. Just tastes like a, a more potatoey potato mash. I think the mash is better. The pie's better, but I preferred the parsley sauce. It was a little bit more fishy to, to my taste there, but. I think overall, slightly nudges it. Yeah, I thought you said you were always taught to clear your plate. I was, but if we've got 10 of these to eat, <laughs> I, can't, I can't finish every single one. I'm disappointed. I Look at that, it's, just, it's disgraceful. It's only the second one we're at. Get in then, finish it. I've got to be better than that, I can't leave all that. I'll save, I'll save you some, Bruce, I'll no, save you some. it's just gone, you finish oh, it. No, I've, I've got this beef, you know, I've gone being nice. I don't want you going hungry. <laughs> You're going to have to hit the row in later one after today, Bruce, aren't you? Mate, tell me about it. I think I'm going to have to roll blooming across the Atlantic at this rate. There we go, that was Maureen's. What we're going to do now, because I'm getting low on juice, I've only got 27% battery, we're going to go to a charge station, pump some juice in if we can. Genuinely tight already. <laughs> Bing! <laughs> I play a tune on that, mate. Honestly, mate, I am so full. Are you full already? Oh, jeez. I'm, uh, I'm getting. I'm not hungry. I'm not saying I'm hungry. I'm, I'm not at capacity yet. Oh, God. I mean, we literally had a couple of spoonfuls, didn't we? I think it's quite a filling dish, isn't it? It is. It's like, like the pasties. That are yeah. Very, very filling. I need a pea now as well. Starting to get a bit emotional. Yeah, I just out to water. <laughs> two, two, two sessions in. <laughs> and you, it was a poor attempt at that one, Bruce. Oh, was, you, yeah. you barely even had a half there. You barely even had a half. Why am I so fat? I don't think it's going to be one of the easiest things to eat lots of. No. I think, I think fish and chips is easier to eat lots of. I think the pasties th are yeah. easier to eat lots of. Yeah. I think it could be the fishy element. It could be the parsley sauce. We may have got the parsley sauce on the end at some I, point. I was just thinking, I think it's the liquor, yeah. Yeah. Maybe we, we, we no, don't have got, liquor. You've got to have liquor. You have to have liquor. <laughs> do, do I have can to you, have liquor? You do. Can you imagine the furore if we do the best pie mash and liquor and we, we wimp out of the liquor? <laughs> We're we gravy instead. It's gravy. Jesus, you'll get lynched. Bloody we can disgusting. have the liquor in a separate side pot. And we could just taste the liquor. I'm not <laughs> doing a, these we, with you we anymore. Can, we can Listen, I, I might side. moan about being full, but I'm going to see it through. I'm not <laughs> wimping out, changing the rules halfway through. <laughs> Have a word with yourself, man. Bloody disgrace, this. Are you listening to this, people? Are you? I'm just trying to make it easier for you, Bruce. Just trying to make it easier for you. <laughs> That's the problem with today. People always want it fast and easy. Life's <laughs> tough. Life's hard. Show a bit of resolve. <laughs> Records is 10 degrees as well, now. Really? Should have bought the bathers. <laughs> you imagine that? I sat in a couple of sp some speedos with our guts and moves hanging out, scoffing ten portions of pie and mash. I tell you what, we're looking for sponsors. Slimfast would be all over this, all <laughs> over it, wouldn't they? Bruce has just gone for a quick wee. I've got the zero on charge. We've got this. This has got a slow charger, the AC charge. But it's got a big battery on this. I think this is the Cypher Plus, which has got a bigger battery. So we're charging at 42 amps. We're at 30% now and it'll take two and a half hours. So I think we give it, let's give it 40, 40 minutes. 
We've tried to get the uh, Rebel on charge because that takes the faster charge, but this point won't let us charge it two vehicles at once. So that's a bit rubbish. So we're going to have to wait until the zero finishes before we can get some power in the energy kit. Charging, I like to say complete, but uh, we've put 20% in. <laughs> Waited 40 minutes, put 20% in. That's the trouble with the slow charge, isn't it? You need yeah. the fast charge. You really, really need the fast charge. Yeah, it's, I think it's essential for a bike. If you stay over an hour, there's a hundred pound charge as well. So if you walk off and leave it and go over an hour, you get a hundred pound fine. So we did about 45 minutes. We've now got 56 miles range, which will hopefully do us. So what has been good though, we've waited for 50 minutes and now, I'm is, that some, is that some hunger pains I feel? <laughs> No, it's not. It's indigestion. <laughs> I am genuinely struggling to do up this jacket and vest. Uh, is, it next to, is that an F cook? There it is. F -cook, on the right yeah. there. There's Wash. a little parking space right outside as well. Let's do it, Chops. Let's do it. That's what we're here for. Ooh. You that? Lovely liquor, Bruce. <laughs> Lovely liquor. Right. Vinegar? Number three. Vinegar? It's chilli. It's vinegar or chilli, wasn't it? Chilli vinegar. Chilli vinegar. Go on then. Shall I go first? Mash first. Which mash is a different kind of mash? Yeah, it's got a little lumpy bit in it. Mm. It's a nice pastry. Yeah. Mm. That's nice. Best mash. Best mash. Best mash. Absolutely best mash. I wonder if it's got something in there. It's not just mash, maybe it's got a little bit of butter. Just a little bit. Yeah. It doesn't, it's not like as potato -y, if that makes sense. I'm going to try the liquor. Quite a fishy liquor. Lovely wow. pie, isn't it? That pie's got, it's got a lovely of taste. That, the crust on it, like the mm. sort of a burn, not burn, but like a nice crispy crust, isn't it? Like chunks of meat and stuff in oh, there. I, well, I didn't get to the meat, though, man. Oh, Look at the gravy coming out of the pie. This is hands down the best so far. F Cook, I think, is at the Top of the tree. What's this place called? F Cook. F Cook. Absolutely. F -cook. Top of the tree. Very, very nice. Best mash. Best it's pie. Just, it's just it's distinctive, isn't it? It's I, different. I'm really had enough of the liquor now, if I'm honest. Okay. I, I, yeah, I'm not. I'm, I'm not. I'm not feeling that fishy flavour. I think without the liquor, I'd be enjoying it more. I, I'm not sure oh, about I, that I liquor. I like this one. It's nice, but I've I've had enough of it now. We will press on though because I have to have liquor. <laughs> have what? We'll press on and order liquor, but <laughs> I've had enough of it. There we go, F Cook. Top of the tree at the moment. Onward. Right, so it's the great bike swap. I am now on the zero. And I'm going to have a go on the energy cack. This has got a very different position, this, isn't it? The bars are much higher, it's much more naked like, I suppose. You sit a lot lower than this, don't you? You do, yeah, the pegs are even a bit higher. Yeah, I feel much higher overall. Definitely higher. Foot pegs are a little bit higher as well, I yeah. think bit more on its nose it feels I would say first impressions mm. oh should have gone there oh well sorry it's not a good start is it <laughs> the seat is actually quite hard on us as well isn't it if compared to that my really... ass he's just gonna moan isn't he he's just gonna moan the entire time <laughs> I got to admit I, I prefer that I prefer the Energica to this is it this left yeah I think it is uh, where's all the traffic this is London I know what's going on Oh, I spoke too soon about the traffic, didn't we? Yeah. These pie and mash places, it, they're very, um, it's, it's a certain clientele in there, isn't it? It's definitely something for the locals, isn't it? Yeah. If you look, it's all, it's all the local people, a lot of older people who've been coming yeah. all their lives, probably. But you're made to feel very welcome. Do you not find you that? Yeah, very welcome. It's very not welcome. like, oh, who are you? You don't come from here. People are very welcome to you, welcoming. And, and the prices are good as well, aren't they? I mean, Amazing. It's like Four quid for yeah. pie and mash in London, you know. It's it's incredible. Turkish restaurant. So the pie and mash shops they've got so much competition now from <laughs> what they used to have, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. just everything now, isn't there? Do you know but I mean the pie and mash pie mash and liquor is a dish that is screaming out for like 
somebody in v on Vogue to, to, to pick up, isn't it? And like yeah. make it a Des Reyes dish again. Yeah. Because people are all about, oh, it's a traditional, it's a traditional London dish. You know, it's the sort of thing that people would just jump all over, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And a lot of them are doing like takeaways and trying to mm. get, you know, onto it that way, but you're right. I mean, what the people we've seen in the shops yeah. are all locals, aren't they? You've not, not seen yeah. any tourists nah. in there, really. But I think maybe part of that might be because you look at where the places are, uh, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, we end up back where we came now. You hear, uh, like, the bikes and stuff with, with an engine, a traditional bike. And you think, oh, how antisocial. <laughs> you, do, you do a bit, don't you? Yeah. yeah. I think it would be all too easy to fall into that looking down your nose at people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> with com combustion engines. How vulgar. Oh, ban them. Ban them. Well, we're not going to need to blur the speedo on this, are we? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, we might have gone over 20 a few times. I was just thinking that. Some <laughs> arsehole will probably go, you're doing 22. No, we're back here again. Yeah, I know. <laughs> God's sake. Anyone see that shit on Charming this is Station? This the third time we've been round here. <laughs> Chaos ensues. The nag's head there. I wonder if Del Boy's in there. Look at that. Oh, and that. We've got the shard there. Oh, the big hunts has arrived in style. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, I just feel more at home south of the water. Yeah, I, I don't. I, I, not north, not north. Nah, there's something about the north of London. I just, I just, don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't feel comfortable there. But put me in the south, and it's like ah, southerners, mate. That's, that goes all round, really. It's better in the south. It's not just a London thing. We're outside in Manzies, Manzies, Manzies. I think that's how you pronounce it. Really handily, there is an electric charge point, fast charge DC. So we're giving the energy a bit of a blast on the charge while we go and eat pies. Bruce is uh, feeling hungry again, so he's ready for another full portion. He's promised me he's gonna clear his plate this time, so. <laughs> Seriously, I can hardly do this up. <laughs> that was before we started eating pies. One thing we're loving with the Zero is the uh, boot, isn't it? The boot's really handy. Yeah. In the boots. <laughs> feeling hungry. Bruce, after you mate. I right. think I started last time. First off, get the liquor. I'm going off the liquor. A bit less fishy that. It is. There's less parsley as well. Mmm, there's a lot less flavour in that liquor, isn't it? It's a lot more bland, it's a lot blander. Yeah, it is much more much much blander, isn't it? Yeah, quite a nice, quite well seasoned bit of mash that. Yeah, it's more taste. Mm. Well actually. Not as, not as potato -y. it's not as mash as it was, but there's more salt. Mm, there's definitely more salt in it. Maybe not the best one we've had. It's going to be really difficult to place these pies, isn't it? Yeah. It's got a nice chunky filling in it. You can tell we're in South London, that's all I'm going to say. I, really, I like the pastry, I prefer the pastry on that. It's like drier and crispier. Yeah. But the meat, the meat isn't as flavourful. And it's quite watery, the meat, isn't it? Much more gravy. It's, it's it. a bit more runny, the gravy, maybe, yeah. isn't it? It's not as tasty as certainly the last one. But it's a bit difficult to tell because we haven't had the liquor on it, mm. though. And it does make a difference, doesn't it? If you pour a bit of liquor over it. Drown it, come on. Drown, Drown it. it. There you go. All over. <laughs> but the liquor's not as strong as the other liquor, no, is it? Not, no. mm. The liquor does complement it, I think. Oh, we can't leave this little bit here, Bruce. He's going to get lonely on his own, sat there. I think we've got another, at least another one. We've got time for another one, I reckon. One more, there's next one, one more. Definitely. And we've got to clear the plate on this one. We do. One each at the next one. Don't one each. <laughs> So the energy has been charging, come out, it must have stopped because it's only at 68%, but 
Let's put another 20% in it. I don't know why it stopped. Some of them might have been a smart I can press the stop button as they walk past. But we've got 68% and it finished what it was doing by the time we'd had our pie and mash. Hey Bruce, I think your airbag's gone off, mate. Oh no, no, it hasn't, don't worry. <laughs> Uh, can I just say one thing? What's that? <laughs> oh, <laughs> so gruesome. I'm sorry. I'm, sorry. I'm sorry, viewers. I'll, I'll give you some idea as to how I'm feeling at the moment. <laughs> Bruce is struggling. He's struggling. Is this the? Is this the last one? Oh, Jesus. How much power have you got in that? In that beauty. Forty-four <clears> percent. <throat> Forty-four. How many miles have you got? Uh, it says 58, but that's oh. town range. Yeah, it'll get you uh, home. No, it won't. I'll need to charge. <laughs> yeah, it'll get you home. It'll get <laughs> you home. <laughs> Definitely will not get me home. <laughs> what do you mean, get me home? I'm having the Energica. I've fagsied this now. I've fagsied Up your arse. Wow, this thing is so fast when you open it up. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. <sighs> oh, speed triple. Yep. One of those noisy ones. So uncouth these petrol engines. Oh, don't they make a don't they make a row? Goddards of Greenwich. Final part of the mash of the day. Gonna eat all this one. Hungry? Let's do it. Well, you finished it up, have you? I have, I'm in. There's an old pro now, look at them. Oh, look at this guy, we know exactly what we're doing, don't we? Made a bit of meat. It's okay, it's not, not the best one. No? Mm. Let's have another bit of meat, hang on. The meat's quite nice. That third one is still the winner, isn't it? That was the fourth one, wasn't it? That was the one we just come from. No, the, the one before the one we just come from, the one that was still up in the north. Maureen's. No. <laughs> F. F. Cook and Hoxton. Oh, wait, the F. Cook. It's one of those dishes where there's actually not much between them. No. But if you go for like the fish and chips, you can see that chip, fish and chips really. Do you know what I mean? There's more of a range between them. These but, are all very yeah, similar. But that F. Cook one, F. Cook and Hoxton. Yeah. Hands down was the best. Yeah. That, that was just a different week. Yeah, right? I think you're right. Even though this is the fifth one of the day, I am still enjoying it. I am as well, actually. Yeah. I, I do find this um, slightly milder parsley sauce yeah. easier to lick and slightly easier to, slightly easier to go down yeah, yeah. and the more fishy stuff. Well, we're, we're going to uh, bash these out <laughs> and then I think we'll get some official verdicts once we bash these out. Because we're going to have to charge to get all what he wants. Well, maybe. We'll, we'll see, maybe not. Smashed it. Bruce is flagging. Well, there we go. Goddard's at Greenwich. We're done. The last pie and mash. We both finished our plates. I've got 60 miles range on the uh, energy on the Energica on the Zero, which is 40% battery, but that's of course acclimatised for riding in town. We're going to go back to Bruce's now. I'm not going to charge it up, I'm going to make it. Bruce says I won't make it, I say I will make it, and we're going to get back to Bruce, which is about 30 miles. So <laughs> I think we've got about 60% in the Energica, 40% on here. So. Uh, Let's see if we make it. Nice that mate, wasn't it? A bit of, bit of, bit of Goddard's. I do sausage rolls in here and all. Oh, bread and, but bread and butter pudding. We should have had a dessert. Bread and butter pudding to finish off with. Did you just say we should have had a dessert? We should have had a dessert. Bread and We could have gone for a bread and butter pudding, e pudding each, couldn't we? Right, so you reckon? We, I reckon we can make it home on these. I think you're talking out your dung shoot. The pie and mash Bruce, I think that was uh, that was a success mate I'd say. F Cook and Hoxton definitely number one. Yeah, yeah that was good. That, that was the hunt doing it for 150 years. You know, yeah. 
it, it was good that wasn't it it was and again it's it's not saying the others weren't good because they were but there was a definite difference between that and everything else yeah that one was right at the top and i think all of the others were very very close weren't they yeah, very yeah, very they close it's interesting though we were saying this in in the latin goddards there weren't we that it seems the north and south of london have a different way of doing pie and mash and yeah. liquor like the the liquor is well i thought it's much stronger with parsley but you think it's fishier i but think it was more fishy yeah there's a definite stronger taste in the liquor yeah. and the mash in the north seems to be like it's just potato there's nothing else in it yeah whereas in the south it, there's the whether they've salted it or like you said maybe they've put butter in it a little bit maybe a bit of milk or something just a little yeah. bit there's a different taste isn't there to the mash yeah yeah it could and be the potatoes where they're growing in the north and growing in the south you know other side of the river <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, soil. Yeah. Uh, uh, left, isn't it? Yeah, left. Straight left. on, man, sir. Nah, left. Do nah, left. straight on, mate, sir. Oh. I've, I've rerouted it. He, he knows his stuff. Still yeah, if you just did the left there, it would have cut out all this. Oh, well, it would have got cut out all this. You know, why, why, why would you listen to somebody that's been here for 20 years? <laughs> yeah. Why? Google, I've got Google's telling me differently. He knows his stuff, you know, that Google man. I've got to cut in front of this guy now. Yeah, cut him up. Go, go. Oh, you're shit. Well, I should have gone then, shouldn't I? You should have. I've got to nurse it, mate. I told you, I'm getting this home on the back of this car. I can't You're not be getting that home. A great acceleration. You are not getting that home. So, Bruce, the next one, the next one will be back on your channel again. And yep. we're, we're toying with the idea of the big one, aren't we? The one we mentioned originally. Yeah, shall we mention it now or not? Mention it, go. Uh, I think we're looking at best haggis in Scotland. I've never been to Scotland on a motorcycle. So, it's about time, and why not? sample some of that haggis I've heard, I've heard they're tricky to catch though Bruce to catch a haggis it's quite tricky isn't it they're quite you know they're, they're, they're quick on their feet you've got to get them in season you have ah. to get them in mating season because ah. what happens is that they have long left legs front and rear and short right legs front and rear and they always go <laughs> clockwise around the mountain but in the mating season they go a bit too lally that's when you can catch them and then they, they go anti-clockwise so you ask why they fall down the hill and you catch them at the bottom so that's what we're doing a bit of haggis hunting in scotland as the next big hunt so if you're not already subscribed to bruce's channel i'll put a link to it at the bottom in the description and at the top go and give him a sub he's got some awesome content and he's if you want gentleman. to see our fish and chip video if you didn't see the fish and chip video which is also on bruce's channel why not check it out <laughs> Yeah, why not, first of all? Why didn't you? Where have you been? And if you haven't seen the pasties, this is your first big hunts you've seen. I'll link it at the top again. Best pasty in Cornwall. I've also got a playlist of all the big hunt stuff on both the channels, so you can find everything on the big hunts playlist. But thanks for watching, guys, as always, and we'll see you on the next video. Cheers. See ya! Hiya! We're here, two minutes away. I've got 10% battery oh, and wow. 10 miles range, mate. I, I genuinely thought you'd be down to about three or 4%. They obviously have, like I said, the battery technology is a bit better, isn't it? They get better every year, don't they? They get, they literally get better every year. So we're there, I've done it. Proof Bruce wrong. I knew, I knew I'd do it, I knew I'd do it. Bruce is going, you won't do it. I knew I'd do it. We are here, we made it. See you later, guys.